Hello everyone, Crystal Fisher here. Look at this, how strange these things are. What the hell even are they? Anyway, this is our Ratchet and Clank into the Nexus, uh, or, or just Nexus, because uh, I'm Australian, so therefore it is. Uh, yeah, and uh, so today we're still in the planet, whatever it was called, but I wanted to explore the uh, lovely, what is this thing called again? The love, the lovely, um, um, yeah, the orphanage, that's it. Okay. It sounds like the progs may be connected to the evacuation of the sector. It looks like the rifts were created during some sort of temporal disruption eons ago. Like a hiccup in the space-time continuum. With the right equipment, we may be able to amplify the anomalies and bring out Mr. I. Of course, we'll need some room to experiment. Neff says he knows what to do about them. By this time next year, the entire sector will be ours to experiment with. Oh, uh, okay. A hiccup in the space-time continuum? She's talking about the Great Clock. Interesting, interesting. So, so basically, what, Mr. I comes from a different dimension, you know, maybe, uh, like the nether, the nether regions. <laughs> nether regions, yeah. Um, and then maybe, yeah, so if they're different creatures, maybe they want to bring, bring him back. Okay. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. And I kind of like that idea of a plot point, you know, like, like these guys are, you know, they're orphans or whatever, and they just want, you know, someone similar to their kind or whatever. Um, but I like that a lot. I actually do like that a lot. Um, and I think the guys are home. Yes, they are. They're home. All right. Pause. Anyway, enough of that. Sorry, another interruption. Of course, it, you know, it, it has to happen in my in my house. There's got to be people living. There's people living. There's people loving. There's people talking. And you know what? That's what happens. So let's continue with the distraction. Oh God! I cannot stop singing the praises of this weapon. It's the best one ever. Oh, and we can upgrade it. I mean, not upgrade. Actually, you know. What? Yep, let's upgrade it again. Actually, well, for the first time, let's just use all seven on this, okay? Here we go. Three, three, two, one. Upgrade. Mystery upgrade. Oh, stop opening, your stupid door. All right, okay. There you go. Look at this. Oh, here we go. So what does this give us more rare attainium? That's what it seemed to be, the upgrade path that was going down. Where are we? Where aren't Where aren't we? Whoa, that's some cool stuff. This is like an orphan. This orphanage kind of seems. It can, this orphanage seems awfully depressing. Get it? Ha ha ha. Okay. Um. Where the hell are we going? We're just continuing down here or something? Or, uh, do not know what the. F where the hell we have to go? Maybe around here, I reckon. Look at the, the paintings on the floor and stuff, and like hopscotch and stuff. It's kind of. Yeah grim. It's very grim, very strange and kind of surreal feeling, you know. It looks like a bloody dungeon down here. Bloody torture dungeon. I mean, seriously, what kind of orphanage has their kids stay over here? It's just bad, it's bad organisation now. Oh, right, okay. We got a uh, thing. Where is it? Oh, there we go. Enter rift. All right. Let's do this. Now, I bet you there's a skill point that requires you to do it quickly. And I bet you there's also a skill point that, you know what? Fuck it, we're exiting. Let me just die. Two, three, four. Boom. It makes a funny sound. I want to do... I bet you there's one that requires, like, you not to get hurt the whole time. Ready? So let's give that one a go. Okay, ready? Right, there we go. See, so you can slow down. That, and then, yeah, there's probably one that requires you to do things quickly as well. That's the thing. Alright, those crystals look nice. Alright, anyway, let's... What are we doing here? Push. Push me. And then just touch me. Till I can get my... Alright. Satisfaction. Okay. And there we go. 
shit. Oh god. This one's scary. This one's... Oh no! Far out! I had that. I had this. I legitimately did actually have this. It's a bloody game. All right, push. What's going on? Oh, you're going to push out like... What the freak? There we go. Ah, bloody Omnisphere, whatever it is. Bastard. Bastards they are. They are bastards. Nice work, pal. You said that last time, pal. Oh shit. Shit. Idiot. Okay. I always love doing that, like using the helipack thing, because it just gets you there quicker and it it's more fun, you know, but you gotta you gotta calm down sometimes. That's the trick. Just calm down, relax. There's no rush. Except except when I'm playing, because I always feel like there is. Right, anyway, let's continue through. Ready? I'm gonna do it again. Fuck it. Yes, yes! Save me. Is it ready? You're a rude fucking pig. They built their own dimension in there? You have to concentrate on who you wanted to find. This off, you stupid fuck. My friend, I got family problems too. Don't be afraid to share your pain. And there you are, baby. That's a lot of pain. between our worlds are wearing thinner by the day. No. No one knows about planet Silas. The city's been abandoned for decades. We saw to that. I'm scared. I'm terrified. Come on. What happened? Wait. We gotta go. Oh, oh, oh yes. Oh, oh, down there. Yes, in the chasms. They are nethers. They are nethers. Uh, can we reach them? No, we can't. Wait. I reckon we can. Wait. You know what? We can here. Boom. Oh, this is the greatest weapon of all time. I want to get it to level two. I cannot wait. Walk, walk. Thanks, Cork, but that's really not necessary. Not at all. I wasn't doing anything important. I'm on my way to Zarkov right now, and I'm bringing your ship. I'll key in on your nav unit and radio you when I arrive. Cork out. Cork out. All right. Oh, yes, he fell. How many left? Oh, right. oh shit. Oh god, this is madness. This is madness, and it isn't Sparta. Just hang on. We're almost through, almost through. Please get to the... No, no, I want it. I'm so close. Wait. Give me more. Give me some more. No. Oh, fuck. Every bloody bit of ammo has is not... Oh, my God. So close. We could legitimately get to the next level. And let's just get the Omni Blaster up. I reckon we get to level three practically by the end of this level. Look at, look at that. Christ. Easy. Sorry about Kronk and Zephyr. They were true heroes. 
Thanks, Quark. I... Just let it out. Let it all out. Don't be afraid to cry. That's a brave Lombax. All right. That's enough of that. The twins are using some low-rent dimensionator. We need to make sure the real one is safe. Not to worry. It's on display in the secure wing of the Intergalactic Museum of History. It's virtually impenetrable. If we destroy this one, the Progs will be unable to bring over any more nethers. Ratchet, we must get to planet Silox. Yes, let's spend more time in this haunted sector filled with insidious space demons. Relax, Quark. It isn't haunted. But if you like... Maybe you can just support us from space. Good idea! A tactical patrol from the cosmos! Love his voice actor, by the way. Well, it looks like we're done with that level, I reckon. Except for when we gotta come back and when we get the grind or whatever, the hover boot things. Alright, we now have a ship. Yes. I forgot how to pronounce that, by the way. Like, Alpheon, Alpheon. Like, Al Alpheon? Like, that's not even try. Okay, anyway, I think that's it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it we can do now. So, two out of three. Yep, 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 yep. One out of one. Let's fly to the next planet. Here we go. Crag. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll go to Crag in the next part. So thank you very much for watching. In the next part, we're going to be going to the Destructor Palooza. That should be fun. That should be a lot of fun. It's going to be nostalgic, bringing back memories from Ratchet and Clank 2 and 3 and four to an extent. All right, thank you for watching. See you later.